Cindy Rule. You may know me from such plays as Courage in the Storm, the William Davidson story, or Base is Loaded, where I played a delightfully sassy bootlegger named Maud. About a year and a half ago, the Friends of Bowbears Island did a fundraiser at The Rod. I asked Dr. Sean McCarthy if I could sing a song. He gave me a poem by Michael Whalen, which I adapted slightly and created this tune. Enjoy! Oh, hear the whistle sounding, my friends, we must away. Along the track is bounding, the train is underway. And as we leave Newcastle shore, the time we shall beguile, singing songs of days of yore and lovely Bowbear's Isle. Ah, uh, there it stands, that bit of land, well water round it flows. Upon the silent surface still, a stately forest grows. What memories surround the place, what chronicles are piled. Upon the dusty tomb of time, on lonely Bowbear's Isle. Our histories record the fact that many years ago, one thousand souls dwelt on that isle, can you believe it so? One thousand hearts beat happy there, a thousand faces smile, when France's flag was planted there on Bonnie Bowbear's Isle. But pestilence came down on them, small sore on every side, till most of those one thousand souls in desolation died. Uh, let us hope those suffering souls were free from every guile when summoned to the throne of God from lonely Bowbear's Isle. Its history of shipbuilding is interesting, my friends. Began with William Davidson, whose bad luck would not end. When Mr. Fraser took the reins, the gods of fortune smiled on all of those who built the ships on Bonnie Bowbear's Isle. Many ships were crafted there in Joseph Russell's day, and hardly ships they were the best, or so the legends say. But now no sound of axe is heard, no auger saw or files, because the shipyard said goodbye to lonely Bowbear's Isle. The ancient buildings standing there are tumbling to decay. Oh, has the glory of the place forever passed away? Well, all around the lonely ground, the face of progress smiles with blessings on the dear old days on Bonnie Bowbear's Isle. And may the future age erect a grand memorial pile to all of those who lived and died on lovely Bowbear's Isle. 